But I tell you, uh, my mother knocked the ego out of me the first day. What did she do? She well, beat, she beat you. She yeah. <laughs> I came down from my room. I lived upstairs, and I had a bathrobe on. I had a towel around my neck because that's mm -hmm. what opera singers do. Yes. So I sat at the table, and my mother said, "Gene, could you throw the garbage out?" So I looked at her. I said, "After I'm done with my morning tea." Well. Oh, because you thought you were a celebrity. Yeah, she, the backhand, I never saw her coming, popped me in the face, threw me off the chair, the towel went flying to bed. Mm -hmm. I took the garbage out right then and there. <laughs> she knocked the ego out of me right away. Yeah, yeah. Which you had to do. You can't do that anymore these days. You could do it. You just got to get ready to go to jail for the day. Yeah, yeah. I actually got to go to jail for 10 minutes because now they let everybody out. They, yeah, they, uh, yeah. Well, I don't know about that. Do they? Yeah. Is that what's going on? That's a that bail reform thing. That The know, bail reform thing. Yeah. You know, Oh, he, he he didn't do it, so let him out. So if they you, let him out, and he does it 28 more times. If you if you beat your kid. Everything. Everything. No matter what they do, they're out in an hour. Mm -hmm. You know, which I think is the wrong way to run, but I'm not the mayor. Yeah. If I was the mayor, I'd tell you what, the city would be a lot safer. Yeah. There are people are, the crime. We're fed up. They kept, because in the 70s, New York was oh, a tough place. New York, Bronx was burning. Yeah. Terrible. Yeah. You know... Then Giuliani came in and he cleaned up Times Square. And I get it. Mm -hmm. You want to make it more homey for families. But take those businesses and put them somewhere else. There should be a red light district everywhere in every borough. Mm -hmm. With the peep shows and the prostitutes. So in each, the Bronx, Manhattan. Wherever you're going to put it. Queens. Just in yeah. a rural area. Well, it's, not it very rural. it's not very rural in New York. Right. Well, take it and put it on 11th Avenue. But there should be a place for for uh, peep shows, horny horny people. I believe so. Yeah, sure. I believe rape that rape was down when there were prostitutes on the street, because uh -huh. a guy, not me, a guy could get rid of his urges. Yeah. That way, mm -hmm. and it didn't reform into something violent. See, I'm not. I, th this isn't the New York that I know. I, I moved here in 2014, so you know we got the Harry Potter store by yeah, here. We didn't have not the Potter. same kind of place. No. Not with the. I haven't seen, no. I yeah, that I was post Giuliani. I think you know you have to play a fine line with politics, mm -hmm. and I think Curtis is too outspoken, as are so many other people. But you got to have nothing to to gain. Mm -hmm. You can't do it for self growth. You, it's, you have to ask people. what you can do for your country. Right. Yeah, you not know, what. What your can country I do can for do. this city? What? Yeah. What so what, if you want to change anything in New York City, I didn't know we'd go in this direction, but I yeah. find it interesting. If you want to change something in New York City, what, what would you change about the city? Because you've been living here your whole life. All my life. You're born in the Bronx. Born and raised. So you've seen a lot of different iterations in yeah. New York City. So what, 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 like, what do you make of our current situation? It's terrible. It's terrible. Is it like it was in the 70s? Well, I was a kid in the 70s. Yeah. I was 10, 11, 12 years old. Mm -hmm. I remember the 80s and the 90s. And there were streets you couldn't walk down in Manhattan. Mm -hmm. And I like that. Because if you didn't want to go there, you didn't go there. It was like a red light district of getting right. your ass but kicked. But it was also people that were freakishly stupid wouldn't congregate in Times Square or by the Broadway theaters. They would go on the outskirts. Mm -hmm. And they would do their business on the outskirts. So you think Giuliani, by cleaning it up, actually kind of made more problems? Is that what you're saying? Different problems. Different problems. Different problems. The problems, they change. Right. Okay, that's pretty interesting. You know, I know a girl who rides the subway to work, and she's been seeing the violence. And she's a staunch mm -hmm. uh, anti-Trump, anti-Giuliani. And she says she's scared to ride the train now because yeah. she wants police presence. But you can't have police presence unless the mayor puts the police on the street and tells them to do their job. Mm -hmm. You know, right now you're walking out of Pathmark with... Filet mignons, they can't do nothing to you. You could take a steak? You take a steak. I didn't even know any of this stuff. I had a friend of mine who works at Home Depot. They lost $7 million last year because they cannot stop the shoplifters, even if they catch them. Really? There's no sense. You're going to have him arrested. He's going to go to jail. He's going to come out in 15 minutes. 15 minutes. going to go in front of a judge, just slaps him on the hand. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know, now they want to get rid of solitary confinement in the prisons. Mm -hmm. But aren't you supposed to go to prison... To see how bad it is so you don't do what you did again so you stay home. To reform you. Right. It should be about... So if you have iPhones and computers in jail yeah. and streaming services and cable, wh what are you doing? You're making life mm -hmm. like the Park Avenue Hotel? It's supposed to be bad. They have, they have 
Netflix and phones yeah. and stuff in jail yeah. now? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah. You know, in Scandinavia, they have PlayStation 3. In prison? Yeah. I don't get it. Unbelievable. I don't get it. Mm. At least it's not PlayStation 5. Right. But yeah. And if it's not working, yeah. fix it. Mm-hmm. If you see violence is going up, reverse the, your decisions because yeah. it's not working. I don't know. I mean, that. You, do you know, like, where do you get your Elvis clothes, though? Is there someone oh, that I makes them for made. you? Or? Yeah, custom made. Yeah. Yeah.